Like, that is just an adorable face. It's like a very calm tree. This I got from my grandmother. I love this one. Yay. There we go. Santa swinging, <laughs> having fun. They have the stockings. This is Jen. ASMR. Subscribe before you fall asleep. Hi there. My lovely, lovely fist. I hope that you are all well. This evening I am doing a little lo-fi um, Christmas tree tour, I guess. And the house is quiet for a little while this afternoon, so I thought this would be the perfect time to film this video. So yeah, I'm just going to go through the decorations and stuff and chit-chat all lo-fi audio. I'm just filming with my phone too. Hi. <laughs> so yeah, so we actually have two trees this year. We have this tree, which is our fancy tree, <laughs> kind of. Um, this is just because it's a real tree. You can see. It's a nice real tree and it is about 165, 75 centimeters. So like five, eight, five, nine, something like that. And we decided that we would only put a select amount of decorations on here so it would be a nice, pretty tree. And we have a second tree which I'll show you after. It's the kids' tree and they were allowed to do whatever they like. And although my daughter tried to like keep it nice and you know pretty, my son just wanted to put everything. <laughs> the only thing that's missing is the kitchen sink. You're gonna be like, whoa. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna stick with this tree a little and then head over to the other one. So yeah, they're both in the big room. So this one is in the dining room kind of kids toys area and the other one is under the stairs. So. They're both, like, visible when you come into the house, kind of thing. So, we decided that we were going with a Nutcracker theme this year. Um, and we kind of stuck to it and kind of didn't. <laughs> but, I mean, we do have more Nutcrackers this year than we ever have, so that kind of works. Starting with a six-pack of these guys. How cute. <laughs> they don't do the little movie thing they're just like little hanging decorations. We have six of these, I think two blue and four red, I think, a dark blue, a light blue, and then all the red ones. Um, I think most of the decorations on this tree are all new ones, and all the ones on the other tree are all the um, older ones that we've had for a while. So, we have the little nutcrackers, and we have the baubles, of which I think we have two packs. One pack of, like, fully just gold, like this one here. And then one pack of fully red, with a touch of gold in some of them. That's some cool texture there. I might, like, try and find time to do, like, a little decoration trigger no talking thing I don't know if I'll have time to do that this year but a little bit there um, what else we have a little mini and Mickey here's Mickey um, I grabbed these in was it in Jiffy I think it was in Jiffy yeah little Disney Gingerbread men. Oh, so cute. Where's Minnie? Let me show you Minnie. She's up there. The little Minnie one here. It doesn't really go with our theme, but I just thought they were so cute. You know, like, there's a lot of Disney stuff that's just not that cute. I just dropped Minnie. <laughs> Sorry, Minnie. There we go. Pop Minnie back in. I'm 
but she fell down. <laughs> Sorry, Minnie. What else do we have? I have a little acorn here. It's a little glittery, which is not my favorite, but it looks pretty. These came in like a set of three of like autumnal kind of decorations. So like two packs of different ones. I got them before Christmas though. They were like autumn ones. Another nutcracker. This one's a little red one. Oh, his head's a little squint. I thought it was loose there. No. It's just a little patch of beard. <laughs> it's not And then the little squirrel. I have two of them. Um, you might have seen these squirrels. I got them when I went for that shop with me um, Christmas shopping video. A little bit of fluff on him there. There we go. So we have two little squirrels in here. One here and one over there. You can see them in the back there. Oh, we have another squirrel. It's not a fluffy one, but this one. It's more like, um, you know, they kind of look like, here, like this one. Kind of look like blow molds, but like little glass ornaments. So that one was cute. And then another couple of them. Gold or red. Golden red ones back there. So that's what there is around here. And what do we have over here? Oh, this one, of course. This one is the Shwapu, which is the sorting hat, which was actually made by one of my Patreons. My patrons. There we go. <laughs> How cute is that? When was it? 2020? Oh, darn it. What was your name? Oh, I've forgotten your name. I'm so sorry. I'll pop your name on the screen. Thank you so much. I still put them up every year. Um, the Disney ones on the kids' tree. I think you did like a uh, Mickey Mouse one too. It's on the kids' tree. But this one's for the grown-up tree. Pop that back in there. I'm not doing great with one hand. <laughs> there we go. Pop that back. Another nutcracker. Some baubles. And a mushroom. <laughs> this was in the autumnal selection too. And then we have the little British letterbox. A little bit of frost on the top. The kids wanted to write tiny little letters to Santa and put them in there. But we didn't end up doing that. There's still time though. <laughs> Maybe I'll put little secret messages to them in there. So next time they're playing about with it, they'll be like, oh, like somebody's put a letter to Santa. <laughs> okay, and the lights. I didn't say anything about the lights. I just have one string of warm white lights. Everything's a little extra warm um, because the light that I have on in the back, like behind me, is also a warm light. So it's very yellowy. <laughs> yellowy green but that's okay it's a little sparse like because it's a real tree obviously we can't like fill out all the different areas with greenery and stuff like you can with the plasticky trees but it looks pretty good I think oh here we have another decoration a little owl a little glass owl And then another nutcracker, or casnoisit in French. There's a, the dark blue one. He looks kind of black, like his outfit looks black there. And the disco ball, the red disco ball, that's cute. And then all the way to the top, we have a nice gold glittery star. This was also a new star. We had one like a few years ago and it's like pretty banged up so I just replaced it with this one. So yeah, that is our tree for this year. Kind of between the 
the games bookshelf and my <laughs> that's my backing for taking photos for eBay and stuff. So yeah, that is our tree and what's in it. A nice tree. I think we got it for like 30 euros in Jiffy. So not very expensive for a nice real tree. And then underneath we have a little tree skirt which is actually just a white faux fur. Just a round one. And we have a bit of leaf, well, needle, needle loss here. So I'll need to shake that out and get rid of those needles. And in the front, we have these guys. <laughs> How cute are these? So we got the little nutcracker. And in front of him, he has a little sign that we can change the numbers to say how many days until Christmas. The kids quite enjoy this one. They like him. <laughs> They're quite well done. They're little wooden ones. Just from like Jiffy. Really not expensive as well. And then on either side of him we have these gorgeous little elves. How sweet are those faces. Like, that is just an adorable face. Look at the little eyelashes too. Oh, these are just so sweet. They're just like plastic. Um, like hollow plastic. But they're, I just think they're just so well done. Like, there is a cheapness to them, but my goodness, are they cute. A little skirt and musical instruments. Oh, um, there's another decoration I didn't show you. A little sparkly autumn leaf. That's pretty cute down here. And then the second elf. <laughs> this one, very similar face, different colored outfit, different stripy tights. <laughs> and then a, a little um, drum with some matchsticks. Well, that's a pretty messy hand, my goodness. Yeah, with some matchsticks to, um, to drum with. These are pretty cute. Actually, Santa was also here with them, but the kids stole two big nutcrackers and there was Santa from this like section. <laughs> the kids stole everything. Like we did have a few more decorations we were going to put on this tree. I quite like the sparseness of it now that everything's done and it's kind of like it's very calm isn't it? It's like a very calm tree. It's not like flashing. There's nothing like swinging around. There's space, there's like, you know, it's nice to look at calmly. So I'm happy the kids stole some stuff. <laughs> um, but we, they did leave us with these, which was nice, because I really loved those elves. And then we have two boards, like one on each side. This one is like an kind of gnomey kind of elf. That goes right. And then on the other side, we just bring him forward a bit. We have Santa. Isn't he cute? Well, those cables back there, just ignore those. <laughs> but we have a little Santa. Isn't he just such a happy Santa? And he's also just a board. And that kind of completes the tree at the bottom. But Santa's not here. Like, the other Santa is not here. But these boards, um, I'm not sure if we're going to keep these at the side of the tree or not. Maybe we'll place them somewhere else once we decorate, like, the rest of the, the house kind of thing. But for now, they're just there. That's cool. Okay, so let's go have a look at the kids' tree. <laughs> My goodness. It's going to be... A shocking change. <laughs> it's gorgeous though, you'll see. Ta-da! The 
this is the kids tree <laughs> isn't it just glorious <laughs> so they got the plastic one this year it's just under the stairs it's plugged in just there so it's cool and they stole Santa <laughs> so they have Santa and they also have the musical Santa in the chimney and they have the nutcrackers, the big ones. I can only see one of them right now. Where's the other one? What did they do with the other one? It's back there. <laughs> oh, what have they done? They have the two nutcrackers. They stole the sled. <laughs> They've got Santa's sleigh. An elf hat. What have they done? My son has obviously been playing with this. There's a little elf hat that we got. Um, there's a reindeer and a Santa and the sleigh. Okay, so he's been playing Santa with the decorations. <laughs> there are some glittery apples there and behind the glittery apples they've stolen the little guy playing guitar that's gonna go in the snow and that's like, um, we have like little figurines of each of us. Hold on. And this is the figurine of my partner, because he's playing a guitar. Although he's kind of a one-man band kind of thing, but... So they stole that. <laughs> we haven't started the setup for these yet. Um, this is... an elf, like um, a paper elf that my son did in school last year. It's got his face, like the photo of his face on the head part of it. Um, so I won't show you that, but... <laughs> there. Um, the nutcrackers here. I got two similar, extremely similar, but not the same. You see they have different hats and different decoration on the, on the jackets and slightly different boots too. So they're pretty cool. And then Santa. <laughs> Isn't he cool? He's just a plastic a hollow plastic Santa, but I just thought he was so nicely done, don't you think? It's just like he wasn't that expensive. Ooh, little furry boots. <laughs> you can see him in the come Christmas shopping with me video. But yeah, it's gonna be difficult for me to show you like actually all the decorations because <laughs> there are so many. And they all have different stories. My goodness. And then if you go up the stairs, we have our little um, kinder socks with our little initials hanging off them. And way up here, we have a little Santa on a swing <laughs> hanging out up there. And you can kind of make him swing as you come down the stairs. You give him a wee push. <laughs> This is, um, it's definitely more joyful than our tree. It's not as calm. And also, the, uh, all the different coloured lights flash, like, all the time. I put them specifically on the setting where it doesn't move and it doesn't flash for this video, but the kids put it on, like, the flashiest of settings as soon as they get home from school. Yeah, I, I calmed it down for you guys. <laughs> I can just show you some random ones. Um, we have a little drum, a little tartan drum, very uh, traditional Christmas for me. Some fries, a hot dog and a burger. I got these this year specifically for my kids, especially, especially for my son. He thinks that's cute. You can see some homemade decorations here. The lovely Santa. I think my son made that at school like last year or the year before. We keep everything here. Some little mice. Um, there is a guy. There, yeah, there they are. The couple. My mom sent me them a few years ago. We have the dangly bear that I love. Um, it's just his hands, like his arms that dangle. I just think he's really cute. We had one year where we got all like wooden, 
like white and wooden decorations. He's from that year there. Some little ice skates where we only have one with a blade. The other one doesn't have his blade. <laughs> that is the stitch ornament that my daughter got this year and my son chose this white squirrel running up a stick. <laughs> Very different styles, but you know, I think anything goes in this tree. The little cute deer. I remember getting him. He's very sweet. And there's a little wooden horse that goes with that pair. His little dangly legs. <laughs> it's cute. A star that my son made, I think. I'm gonna guess it was my son. <laughs> Some clear plastic kind of gem type ornaments here and here. That's actually quite cute all together, these parts there. Because they're all quite similar. Like transparent and everything. And the ring holding all the lights. <laughs> and then their star. It's just my son that chose this star, so... <laughs> it doesn't specifically go with anything. He just chose whatever star he wanted. And that was the one. Let me go down the side. Oh, football. Somebody hit a football under the stairs. <laughs> Didn't see that there. Okay, let me come around here. Um, what do we have? Another handmade thing. Oh yeah, my son was number 12 on the um, advent calendar. I think it was ice crash, like when he was younger. Little Barbie sock from years ago. My daughter had a Barbie calendar, I think. Like advent calendar. We still have that. <laughs> oh, this little angel that I love. She's gorgeous. I love the sound. Listen. Yeah. And this little tree. Very minimalist. Cute. This one. I think I got this one for is more purposes. This I got from my grandmother. I love this one. Yay. I don't know where she was when she got it. I'm thinking like Germany or Russia. It was a while back. Oh, I can't read it. And then down we have these little bells. These were supposed to go on our tree. Actually, they probably still look pretty cute with our decorations. These ones. Some little furry stars. I don't know when I got those. <laughs> Some wooden trees. And then just this like whole section here has absolutely nothing on it. Just nothing. It's not even the back, it's the side. I mean they've decided that doesn't need it. So yeah, they have Santa swinging. Let's swing Santa for a sec. Santa swinging, <laughs> having fun. They have the stockings. And then their glorious, <laughs> glorious tree. <laughs> it is actually pretty charming and delightful. I like it a lot. <laughs> and then they stole the nutcrackers. And Santa, that was for their, the bottom of their tree. And um, the Nutcrackers and Santa was for ours, but um, they were supposed to have the little wooden stand things, or they were supposed to go elsewhere, I'm not sure, can't remember. <laughs> okay, so let me go back to our tree so we can do a little contrast, and then I'll do the little, little outro for you guys. So yeah, so here is the bottom of ours. And then our minimalist, classy tree. So definitely not the same joyful, joyful vibes, but this is definitely a more calm, pretty tree. Yay. Okay, let's do our outro kind of like inside the tree. So, I hope that you enjoyed this video. You found it relaxing. Maybe
Maybe a little interesting to see our trees for this year. If you made it to this point in the video and you're still awake, <laughs> I would like you to pop a little sleepy squirrel emoji into the comments. I want a little sleepy squirrel with some Christmas trees around him and whatever other Christmassy emojis you want to put around that. As long as there's a little sleepy squirrel with some Christmas trees. That'll be cool. And you can just pop that in with your normal comment. For example, you can let me know which tree won. Is it our classy tree or is it the kids fun joyful tree which one you like best i think i already know the answer guys but you can let me know <laughs> the kids will be happy i'm sure <laughs> and yeah if you are just too too sleepy that's fine you can just pop the little squirrel emoji in the comments I hope that every single one of my festive sleepy squirrels are well. Wherever you are in the world, whatever's happening around you, I hope that you can find your own For example, if you are in New Jersey, in the USA, like my lovely, lovely patron, Charity. Hey, Charity. I hope you're well. Thank you for all of your lovely, lovely support. I hope that you all have a lovely, lovely, lovely evening and I'll see you next time